I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Today, we're going to make an apple pie. My favorite is peach pie. What's your favorite kind of pie? That sounds delicious. Today, we're going to make an apple pie. First, we need to cut the apples. Hmm, do you know what we can use to cut the apples? We can't use that. We can't use that. We can't use that. Good job! We can use a sharp knife. Uh, I don't think we're supposed to do that by ourselves. It's always good to be brave when you're by yourself. Look, I'm a pirate! <laughs> that doesn't seem safe. Mmm, everything smells so good. I want to buy my friend some... Buy my friend some cookies. Can you show me where the cookies are? I don't think my friend will like that. I can't mail that to my friend. I want the cookies! Those look so tasty! We just have one more stop in the neighborhood. The package is ready for my friend. They live pretty far from me, so we need to mail it. Wow, it's getting late. Most of the stores are closed. We probably can't send that now. I have to send this to my friend. It's time to go to the post office. Let's send this package to my friend. Their name is... Wait, I don't remember. Can you help me? We can come back tomorrow. You don't have to send that now. No, I have to send this to my friend. Help me. Who does the package need to go to? No, that's not my friend's name. You have to know their name. Great work! Now we can send this to my friend. I hope she likes the cookies. Get my friend a special treat. Where can I buy a treat for my friend? Oh, I know. Let's get them some nice candy. Do you know where the candy store is? Great! Look, why did you do that? Now I can't find the candy store. I don't know where to go. Can you help me? Don't do that! I don't want to go there. I said I don't want to go in there! No! Why is this happening? No! Why can't I stop this? This isn't the candy store. There is nothing here that I want. Maybe you can take us someplace else? I want to get my friend a special treat. Let me out of here! Oh, Amanda. That's... That's a nice birthday card. Do you want to give it to your friend now? Will you address the card? Who should I send this to? I don't think it's their birthday. The card is for someone really cute. Oh, Wooly, it's your birthday! Oh, it's you. Whatever you do, don't... <laughs> oh, no! Wooly had an accident! An accident is when something bad happens, but it's not anybody's fault. <laughs> 
Accidents can happen in your house, at school, at the playground. You can get hurt almost everywhere. At 3.45 this afternoon, we were playing and Wooly tripped and fell. I, I didn't trip. Where on Wooly does it look like he got hurt? That's right! Wooly hurt his knee. Who can help when you are hurting? I don't think they can help. Don't you want to help, Wooly? Why are you even here? Try again! You're almost there! I'm wasting my time and I'm running out of patience. Let's take Wooly to the hospital to see a doctor. This tree stump is rotting too. Do you know why? Things rot when they are not alive anymore. Do you know what the opposite of alive is? Look at the tree stump. If it's not alive, what is it? I don't think we should be talking about this. Are you afraid to think about it? That's right! The tree stump is dead. Dead is the opposite of alive. Good job! Men can die if they don't get enough light or water. Or if they get a disease. Let's go back to our nice picnic. Animals can die in different ways, too. Look at poor Mr. Fox. He is dead and body. What do you think killed him? Amanda, this has gone too far. I don't like this. We saw so many things today. A riding sandwich, a riding tree stump, and silly old riding Mr. Fox. It feels far away. Amanda, nothing is rotten here. What do you think? Do you think that everything rots? Of course not, Amanda. I'm not asking you. Answer my question. You don't have to answer that. Why won't you answer my question? You have to tell me. Do you want to be my friend? Please, answer my question. I think it might be too late. <laughs>